Good morning viewers. Welcome to another wonderful episode of Burnett Life. I hope you all are doing well. Today is a new day. Um, hubby left for work at 2 o'clock this morning. I wanted to record him leaving, but I couldn't stay up any longer. I was extremely tired. We were... um helping him, you know, read over contracts and whatnot. I'm trying to get stuff in order. He left his sticker. His what? He left his sticker. Oh, oh no, those are, those are finished. Those, he doesn't need these. This is just trash. No, it's not. It's not trash. The sticker is on here. No, That's it's not, not trash. Trust me, he... This is not trash. I remember he said yesterday, I need this. Okay. So, hubby is at work. I am a solo mom for the next two weeks. Two weeks. Nah, probably. Hubby, about a week. We gonna say this morning. Morning viewers. Morning viewers. Yes. So let me just let me just make it known. Okay, I am proud of my two children here, Christopher oh and God. Christina, for. One, waking up on time. Two, being just being responsible. Okay. What time did you go to bed last night? Late? Yeah. And we still woke up around twelve. Do you mean that time we all went to bed around twelve? We still woke up around like in seven. Really? Yeah. Just like yeah. yesterday. I'm very proud of my children here. Good morning. Good morning. Do a ten, so. dude. I can't do it. What? What are you doing? Playing solitaire. Are you winning? Yeah. You can't play with other people. My Christopher. So let me just tell you, right? Kristen is my biggest stress. Okay. Especially when Craig isn't here. It is a fight with her. With everything. Waking up. Eating. It's like she always has to find something to fuss and argue about. She's like. Oh. But um. For real for real. Pray for me please. Because I need prayers. Especially when it comes to this picnic right here for real picnic meaning child so let's go see what we're gonna get i have to be careful what i say how i do things you know because the slightest thing i say can trigger her emotions so Kristen, good morning, honey. Alexa, off. Kristen, wake up. Good morning. All right, wakey, wakey. It is past nine o'clock. Come on, it's nine eighteen. Get up this morning. How'd you sleep last night? Is that great? That's good. All right, get up, go brush your teeth, go take your shower, and um, get ready for class, okay? Good job. You want to say your prayers? Hmm? You're not going to tell God thank you for waking you up this morning? I think you should. Kristen. Hey. Focus, let's go. Get ready for class, okay? No, no, turn turn around. Go in the yeah, bathroom. No, I can't do anything. 
What? Water. What happened? I can't get water. No, just go shower. Just go straight in the bathroom. Take your shower. So we're in the classroom. And um, I remember, well, this morning I watched this video on um, GMA. And they were talking about kids choking and whatnot. I had a dream like a few months ago. My kids used to eat ice no, a lot. A year ago. Me okay. Well, Christina and Kristen would okay. eat ice a lot, not me. Yeah, the girls would eat ice a lot. And I just had a dream that Kristen um, was on the garage floor because she had choked, you know. So I told them no more ice or whatever because once Kristen put ice in her mouth, she wants to run around and talk with ice in her mouth and whatnot. So um, I came across this video this morning. This kid was choking in his classroom and um, his teacher saved him. And they were just talking about how um, 5,000 children um, die a year from choking. It's just, it's really sad. But um, Christopher was, Christopher just informed me that he's learning about the Heimlich maneuver in his health class. So this is just like a reminder to you all who's watching. Remember to teach your children about, you know, um, choking signs and also how to help their peers or anyone else who is choking, you know. So that's just... <laughs> that's just that, you know what I'm saying. I'm just, you know helping those on, because I know some people don't like think like that you know and also have um what is it called fire extinguishers in your homes you know um if you are if you have a what is it if you live in more than one story house always have like a ladder in your kids bedrooms because you never know check for your check the batteries in your smoke detectors also check what is it called? Carbon dioxide. Thank you, honey. Your carbon monoxide. Carbon monoxide. Thank That's you, what carbon. Said. You, you said, said dioxide. dioxide. No, I thought it was dioxide. I said carbon monoxide. You said dioxide. I said it, I said, never mind. <laughs> yeah, I said never mind indeed. <laughs> it's, <awesome. laughs> it's monoxide. Say it with me. Carbon monoxide. Yes, thank you, son. You're welcome. Christina, say it with me. <laughs> Sit with me. Co Carbon <sighs> monoxide. It's okay, Shuggy. People make mistakes. It's all right. I didn't say anything. So here's my meal. I have a little bit of rice right here. I have my brock. Oh, I have that. my um crawfish right here. Crab. I also have my um this is the tortilla treats I was telling you guys about. <clears throat> Don't be greedy, take one. So and FYI, I do not like the bag broccoli because it's a little soggy. Then why do you get it? Um, just something quick. <laughs> but um Oh, and in here is the rest of the butter I melted for um right there. Yeah. So okay, so with the this rice is so good. This is like um chopped onions, bell peppers, and spinach with like tomatoes and um butter. Christina seasoned it. Oh so good. She seasoned the she did. Oh. This is like my main course. Why? So I saved the chicken for the kids to eat for lunch and dinner. Oh. And the chickens are mm -hmm. huh. Here's the tortilla treats. Um, I rolled the um, tortillas thin, cut them, and just dropped them in a deep fryer. I know, I know, I know. Not to be eating deep fried foods, but 
I love these. I have given up a lot of stuff, okay? But this stuff right here, you gotta be it kidding helps that. with like a pastry Mojis, type of craving. But it is so Come delicious. Here. So I sprinkled um, cinnamon on top. Now I'm about to drizzle just a little bit of... Um, hold on. It'll put it in there. I'm going to drizzle... What's this? Maple syrup on top of it. Actually, you don't really need the maple syrup. It's really good without it. Listen to this crunch. Mm -hmm. good. We don't need a maple syrup, it's but I'm good. Oh, your oh, business. Christina. I'm gonna just this around time. Just a little, just a little something, something. Excuse me. I was gonna. Oh, excuse me. I'll take that big, huge one. Mmm. How is it? It's good. Uh -uh. What? Two pieces, really? Yeah. Nah, bro. Give me that one back. Why? Nah. Um, because. Three pieces, bro. Oh, come on. Give me that Can one back. This one on mine, please. I'm sorry. I'm going to make one anyway. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Oh, Christina. Stop! Get your dusty hands off. There you go. Thank you. You're welcome. Remember that last one? Go ahead. Mmm. Mmm, that's good. Can I just some more? Like this? What, yeah? Just some more, please. Drizzle more? No, 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 no. You have enough on there. Really a little bit. Well, dip oh, it what? in the on the paper towel. Here you go, Mom. Thank you, honey. Hey, I think we already have our syrup container. Mm. but this is my lunch and also i'm eating earlier because i realized that i am grumpy <laughs> i'm hangry when She's i don't grumpy. when i don't like when i'm hungry man so i figure what i, I eat you? at oh. 12 o'clock and then um i can be a better parent for my kids <laughs> The rest of the day. That's no crabs. Just leave my snow crabs. It's good. Mm -hmm. Done tilling our um garden bed, so we're gonna plant our watermelon seeds. The bag is pretty full. I didn't think we had that much weeds in our garden, but um, this is it? It's pretty heavy. So out here playing with the kids today. It's about that time. Remember to like and subscribe. Hit the notification bell. God bless you all. Mom, Chris, for that life. We're out. Right. We're yes. out. Bye. Yes, said, you walk on the right. You tell your brother to shut his mouth. No, I said. Come I lie. Said, no, 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 I'm not lying. I said, um, and said, uh, and, and, and I also said uh, to the viewers, I also told Chris to shut his mouth. That's Kristen, no. Did you hear it? No, you are, you are writing 30 times. I will not insult my older brother. That's not an no, insult. I will not. Siblings at the end. Okay, honey. No, so, older brother. We'll older see you all brother. tomorrow.